same time you want to be at them all. Welcome back to the Lynn Hayes Freeland Show. We are celebrating 50 years. I want to rewind for just a minute. <laughs> you weren't there 50 years ago. <laughs> you weren't there. You wasn't thought about probably. Uh, you were there 50 there. years ago. Yes, and was. one of the things, uh, when you guys took over the computer lab, you had a list of demands. Tell me what some of them were. Well, I, the first demand was that there would be no punitive measures <laughs> against those students who were in there. Uh -huh. And then um, there were demands um, um, for additional staff, mm -hmm. uh, recruitment efforts mm -hmm. to bring more um, African-American students on campus, mm -hmm. uh, more faculty, um, uh, the curriculum. Okay. Doubling the student body every year until we made 20%. Ah, So okay. that was huge. Okay. Now, when did you get to pay? I got to pet many, many years ago. But, <laughs> but um, not 50. No, not 50. Okay. But so I guess where I'm going with this is when you get to the Pitt campus, how much did you know or hear about what had happened 50 years ago? Oh, the interesting thing is that uh, I love Pitt. <laughs> you know, I love it with all my heart. That's why I do what I do. Mm -hmm. But we didn't hear very much. Hmm. It was surprising to me. It wasn't until a few years ago that I really got engaged. I saw. I saw um, a publishing book, a published book. It was the uh, Blue, Blue, Gold, and Black, mm -hmm. which Robert inspired Hills. me to get involved. Okay, all right. But yeah, there wasn't much discussion about it. And after I got involved, I learned about the rich history, all these individuals who did so much to make it possible for me and my friends to even be on campus. Mm -hmm. And that's a blessing to me. Absolutely. Looking at it, and I feel like we need to carry that torch and we need to honor those individuals. And that's what homecoming is about, Sankofa homecoming. That's what our theme is, mm -hmm. you know, say it loud from uh, rising to, to still rising, excuse me. But thinking about that and considering everything that has been done for us over time, mm -hmm. I really appreciate what I have even more. And it empowers me as an individual to know that these people were here thinking about me and my future. There just the what, same way that I'm thinking about the future of these students of coming the up. Of the students coming up, yeah. And we know there's still work to be done. Absolutely. And so it's very, very important. Um, um, some, of, some of the events will capture that. Um, the panel discussion on Friday mm -hmm. after the Say It Loud book launch. We want to be talking to young people. We have a panel, Summer Lee, mm -hmm. um, um, Brian Burley. The folks dynamic like Summer Lee. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we're going to be tasking them. Mm -hmm. We're going to be talking about, well, where do we go? Okay, let's, let's look at how we did it before, okay? And let's, let's talk about being very, very intentional mm -hmm. about where we move, how we move on. We're doing the same thing on Sunday. We're asking the, the tough questions of, of, of our young awardees. We're asking them about... Um, future uh, forward um, thinking kinds of topics. So now when we say the weekend, are we talking Friday, Saturday, Sunday? Are we talking Thursday, Sunday? Well, some events actually start on Thursday, okay. but all day, all day, all day Friday, Friday until okay. what, 1 p.m., 1 a.m. Uh, in, in the morning. On Saturday, we want people to come out to our board meeting. Uh, and that's at 8 o'clock, and then there's the game, the gala, the after party. The after party. The after we have party the Greek is going to be something. With Greek with stroll the on Friday. It's going to yeah. be amazing. The students That's... are going to have a Greek Sorry, stroll. When, when's the after party? <laughs> the after party. The, no, you, you, you do want to know about that because the after, the after party? party will begin around 9-ish right around after nine. the gala. Okay. We'll convert the, um, the um, ballroom uh -huh. into a party room. Mm -hmm. DJs, old school, new school. Okay. And so, now, is there a website where folks can get yes, more information? What yes, is that? Yes, yes. I think that we posted um, one place, a very easy place they can go is... Um, PitAAC.com, yes. that's Pit our main site. PitAAC.com. Yes. Okay, you can also easy. go to Facebook. Oh, fa oh even better. Who's not on Facebook? Oh, I met somebody the other day who wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But awesome. it is. It's a robust schedule. There are events at the Oaklander. The new hotel. Okay. Uh, there are social events there for individuals who don't uh, plan to go to the game. Mm -hmm. uh, they can hang out at Simmy's. Yeah. We're going to do some things Tailgate. there. Oh, all over. Yes. Sound, yes. Sounds like a plan. I'll yes. see you all over the weekend. Please do. Absolutely. Please, <laughs> Please come. Do. Pit, Thanks for joining yeah, us pit today. AAC.com. Pit AAC or a -A Facebook. Or Facebook. There you go. Sounds like a plan. In the meantime, you know where I'm going to be? Yeah, it's pretty clear. We'll see you there or we'll see you here next week. I'm Lynn Hayes Freeland. Thanks for joining me. Don't forget, Monday through Friday, KDKA Radio.